So hi everyone, welcome and thank you so much for joining. Um, while we don't want to take away from anything that's happening in the world, we even um in the world in Israel especially, we even were thinking of canceling for tonight. But we realized that some of the things that we're going to talk about are actually not even luxuries, but more necessities for some people. I'm specifically referring to Amsela. Um, and because it's health related and some of it is necessities for people, we decided to keep it. And another reason that we decided to keep it on is because I got quite a few texts from people saying that they appreciate that we're doing things as regular as possible because they're seriously depressed and they need some sort of distraction and something a little bit lighter. So this is not at all to take away from anything that's happening, but um, we have it in mind and <laughs> maybe we'll um, we'll say to Helen at the end if everybody wants to. Um, so the way we're going to structure it is we're going to keep it um, short and on point. We're basically going to go through each category, give you like a little intro, um, one, to two, um, one to two main points about it and then questions and answers we got in advance. And then um, we'll open it up to any questions that you may have. So we're gonna start with MSculpt um, because that's the one that is the most asked about and the most popular, and we will start with that. So Bina, do you wanna talk a little bit about it? Yes, um, okay. So I'm sure many of you guys know, like we've been posting about it and you've, you know, a lot of our clients who, came to our locations and you've seen it in person. A lot of you have done MSculpt, uh, but for everyone that didn't, um, basically what the machine does is it targets stubborn body fat. Um, and it's not, MSculpt does help, let's say with your stomach, arms, thighs, like a lot of people do do MSculpt for like cosmetic reasons. Um, a lot of times like you can work out, you can go to the gym, You like let's say you have a pouch after pregnancy, you can get rid of it. So it's a really, really good quick fix um, it's six sessions. It's only 30 minutes each session. It's done twice a week. Um, the way that specific machine works is um, it uses heat to break down the fat and it also uses intensity to contract your muscles. So during those 30 minutes, it's contracting the, um, the muscles 20,000 times. So it's literally like going to the gym for two, three weeks in just one session. Um also, you can't just sign up just like that. We do consultations. We meet you in person. There's like different criterias. Um, also, after the call, I'm going to email everyone individually um, with information regarding all the services we offer, like MSculpt, Chin Sculpting, um, Mcella, and also Cavitation, which we just um, recently started offering. Um, we'll a great, that, yeah. yeah, yeah, which we'll get to on the call. Um, and it does have a lot of benefits like health wise, like, for example, we have um, a lot of clients who um, had, you know, multiple pregnancies, diastasis recti, their abdomen separated. So it really like improved that a lot. Um, and yeah, and we've been having really, really like great results. People who have issues, like, for example, with their back, it strengthens your back muscles. Um, I when I started working here, which was about like a year and a half ago, I decided to try MSculpt on myself because I always had a pouch. Um, no matter like how much I worked out, no matter how much I watched my weight, I literally like even before pregnancy it was like 100 pounds. I always had a pouch. So I decided to do MSculpt um, and I lost it. Thank God. Um, it built muscles and it's only like been positive for me, for my clients. And and yeah. Okay, great. So I'm going to go through some of the questions we got in advance. And then anyone who has questions about MSculpt can ask those before we move on to our next category. So the first question was, who is a good candidate for MSculpt? So the answer to that is, it's not meant for someone whose BMI is over 30. Um, It's meant for people who are in fairly good shape, but just like have that stubborn area that won't go away. Um, it's even better if someone already exercises, this will bring out their results even more. And someone who's eating healthy and has a body mass index of less than 30, um, who is not an ideal candidate for MSculpt, um, women during their period, um, they, you know, it, it can cause extra cramping, um, women who are pregnant, um, someone who's nursing for the first three months should not be doing MSculpt, but they can do it after. Um, people who have electronic or metal implants in their body, 
um, with epilepsy, um, drug pump, drug pumps, uh, recent procedures, and the most. If everyone could just mute themselves, well then let me mute, let me mute everyone. Okay. Um, and the one of the main thing, one of the main um deterrents why we turn people away for M sculpt is um people who have the um the copper IUD, which is a form of birth control. Um, because it's made out of a material that um you cannot do M sculpt with, and that's what why we got the cavitation, which we'll get to. Um, I'll let Bina answer the next question we got, which is, are the results of M sculpt permanent? Oh, let me unmute you. Sorry. Just unmute yourself, Vina. Okay. So like I mentioned before, the machine has two settings. It ha and I'm going to tell you from my personal experience, it has heat and it has intensity. The fat that you lose from the heat is permanent. Um, the intensity is what contracts your muscles. Um, so the muscle definition that you'll have after those sessions, um, if you don't work out, it lasts six to 12 months. But if you do work out and you upkeep it, then the results do last. Okay. Um, is there any downtime? So the answer is no, this doesn't require any downtime. You could literally go on with your day as normal and get up and go. Um, what does it feel like? So it feels like an intensive workout at the gym. Although I have to tell you, we always laugh about it. Women, especially women who have given birth, never ever say it hurts or whatever. The only people we've heard it from are men because yeah. they're babies, even when they have a cold, they're babies. So men could do like, you know, on, they'll do it on like 60 out of a hundred. And they're like, Oh my gosh, this is so painful. And women will do, will go up to a hundred and they're like, Oh, this is nothing. So That's no, true. it's really, it's really not um, painful. Um, Bina, you can answer this. The next question, how fast will I see results? So typically people start noticing um, results after the fourth session, uh, but really um, it's after like about like three, like three, four weeks, give it some time because it still takes time for the body to um, drain out all the fat through the, your, your lymphatic system, which is also important to drink a lot of water after your sessions because it also well, I helps remember, flush. I remember like I knew this because of our training, right? But it was so interesting because when I did M-Sculpt, I did it from May to June and I was done like like June 4th, June 5th. And I remember on 4th of July, I put on an outfit like uh, leggings and like a workout thing. And I was like, it was exactly a month later. And I literally saw like ab definition and lines. And I was like, oh, it makes sense because it's 30 days after. So when people ask us, like, let's say they have a, a wedding or a simcha or whatever coming up, then um, we tell them that you should be done a month before so that you could see the best, best final results within a month after you're done that's so funny you say that by the way because like after I did it I was like so happy because I didn't really I personally didn't care about the app definition I just wanted a flat stomach but then it's like, like I think like two like maybe like a month and a half after I look in the mirror and I see lines and I'm like what right. <laughs> that's crazy like who is that like yeah like I haven't right. done a single crunch like so it's pretty right. cool um, okay. M skull benefits. Um, so actually there are very interesting side benefits to it. One is, is that, um, your posture will be better. So, um, we have a client actually in Tampa that had the craziest back pain. Like she went to every kind of like remedy and therapist and physical therapy, and she was taking medication for back pain. And then after, I think it was just, even after her second session, I remember she gave, she texted us that her back pain like literally almost disappeared. So it strengthens your back um, and you have better posture. Um, it also treats um, diastasis, right? Um, so it's very, very hard to fix that. Most people need surgery, but this will um, create a lot of um, a huge difference. Like how many, um, when that client that we posted a video of, how many fingers worth did she say? It was, it closed up like- Four, around, it was things like four fingers. Right. Yeah. Um, it makes you stronger. So like at the gym, like let's say in my classes, I basically know I have small classes and I have pretty much the same people over and over for years. So I know who can hold a plank for how long, who could do what. And I see that the people who do M sculpt really are stronger. They're able to hold a plank longer. They're able to do more burpees. They're able to do more push-ups because they're using their core better. Um, so regular runners and swimmers may find they can perform exercises faster. 
Um, it also helps to um, delay onset muscle soreness or muscle fatigue. So you get tired. Um, it takes you longer to tire out. You're able to do more in your workouts. Um, so those were all the questions that we got in terms of um, in terms of MSculpt. So before we move on to our next topic, if anyone has a question specifically about MSculpt, not about other topics because we didn't cover those yet, um, does anyone have a question specifically about MSculpt? Please ask. Going once, going twice. Wait. Oh, okay. Um, someone just texted me privately. She wanted to know how many inches you lose from M sculpt. So we've had people lose one inch, um, and we've had people lose five inches per area. Now, in case you think one inch is little, it's not. Like you would have to work out at the gym for months and months to lose an inch on an area. That's that's what one inch is. And if you think about the cost of a trainer and the time it takes to work out and how when you're working out, you can't do anything else, that's a huge thing. Like when I do M sculpt, I'm getting work done or I'm catching up on my phone calls or I am uh, reading or I'm watching something or I'm emailing or whatever it is. When I'm working out, I'm just working out. And um, I could be so tired. Like today, um, I've been in Muncie and Monroe, like I'm exhausted. When I get upstairs, my treat is my M sculpt, you know? Um, I would never be able to work out right now. Um, yeah. so just messaged. Uh, so it makes sense to do M sculpt just for back issues. Yeah, totally. So that's that's kind of what I was trying to say. I'm sure a lot of people could relate to this. Like it's very hard with everything that's going on to get your words clearly. Like I I literally like I, in all my sessions this week, I think I literally forgot my words and my brain is in a fog from everything that's happening. But that's what I was trying to say that. Um, that this is not just for vanity, it's also for health. So yeah, it even if you don't care about your looks, I mean, it's a nice side benefit, but yes, absolutely, it will strengthen your back. Um, someone asked, does it target around the arms as well? Yeah, you could do your biceps, which is here. And most people do triceps, like the, their arm, like when they lift their arm, if they have jiggle here, or like when they wear shells, if it looks like um, like not firm or thick. That's that's what people work as well. That's a popular area. Um, good questions. Um, which areas can it be done? Um, okay, Bina, you want to answer that? Yeah. So you can do um the most popular areas: the stomach, um, love handles, thighs. You can do your outer thighs, your inner thighs, hips. um, your your hips, your glutes, your calves, your arms, pretty much, yeah, any any body part besides the breasts. Okay. Um. Does okay. No, I, we answered that. Are there any side effects? Um. So no. Um. Jokingly, I said that. Um. Someone asked me that the other day. I said the only side effect is you might get like a little addicted to it because like, it's so um easy. You know, it's so easy and so effective that you might just get addicted to it. Um, like we have some people that are on their sixth package, eighth package, you know, like it's a little addictive. I think that's the <laughs> only side effect, but no, it's other true. than that, I always tell people I would put my teenager on it. I would put my mother or grandmother on it. Like I would feel a hundred percent comfortable putting either of those on it. Um, okay. Does it go directly on the skin or over your clothing? Okay. Bina. It goes directly on your skin. Okay. Um, what areas do you do M sculpt on to help your back? So you would do it on your, yeah, you can either do it like where the bra fat is, or you can do it like on the sides on, like, on the lower could, back. So you could also do it on your stomach because we are core. It's all part of our core. So when you strengthen your abs, you strengthen your, your core in general, and you strengthen your back when you strengthen your core. Um, which areas would you do to target the posture? So that's the same answer, meaning you would um, you would do your abs. You could do your back as well, but you would do, if you want to do like two in one where you see results on your abs and strengthen your back, I would say to do the abs. Yeah, a lot of my clients, like they have little kids and they told me like after doing M sculpt, it's like so easy for them to lift up their babies now because they have such like great core strength for a bit. Mm-hmm. Um, wow, really good questions. Is it possible to have too much M sculpt done? So as long as you have a day in between, um, whatever area, like let's say you can't do arms, 
like meaning let's say this specific like let's say you're doing triceps you can't do it monday and tuesday and wednesday thursday but you could do monday wednesday friday um you could do a different area um you could do let's say your abs on tuesday and thursday as long as there's a day in between then no it's it's not too much um and it's not recommended to work more than four areas in one day so um, we have clients that do a lot of areas, like they come in, they do their thighs, they do their stomach, they do their back, um, but they, they just shouldn't do more than four areas in one time. Um, did I mention that it's not recommended for women over 40? No, definitely not. Um, we have people of all ages doing it. Um, we have 60s, 70s, any age could do it. And yeah. Um, if you're over 40, you probably know this, that unfortunately our metabolism only slows down, um, as we get older. And then as you approach menopause later on, there's always that like menopause pooch and it gets even harder to lose weight, to tone up. So if anything, it's even more useful. Um, okay. So these oh, people, so trying to phone you. what, oh, um, these people who do package after package, do they keep doing the same area? Is six sessions not enough? So um, that's a good question. Um, so no, it's the more you do, the more results you'll see. Meaning, let's say, um, okay, Bina, you know what a good example is that we should show? You know that the woman that we posted in deal, like what her results after six sessions versus 12, right? Yeah. If you could pull that up, if we could see I it. Would, like, yeah, yeah. Let me see if I can uh, share it right here. Hold on. Let me see if I have so access to it. Some people do other areas and some people do the same area again because they want more results. Like, you know, let's say they lost two inches on their hips and then they'll, you know, they'll do another round and they'll lose another one to two inches on their hips. So hold on. I'm sending it right now. One second. Let me see if I can do Meanwhile, does anyone have any other questions about MSculpt? Really good questions. We should totally save these questions for future posts. Oh, another question. Can you keep doing the same area repeatedly for let's say a year? You could. Um, the results though, you'll see the amount of inches that you lose will be less and less per time because there will be less to lose. So let's say if you, let's say I'll take hips, for example, let's say you lost four inches, the first six sessions, then the next six sessions, you'll probably lose like three and the next six sessions, you'll probably lose like, um, two, but yeah, you would definitely could. Um, okay. So if you guys take a look at the picture that Bina just posted, so this woman, um, on the left is when she started. In the middle is after six sessions, and then on the right is after 12 sessions. So even after six, she was like blown away. It literally looks like she had a tummy tuck and lost a lot of weight, but she didn't lose weight and she didn't have a tummy tuck. And then after 12 sessions, you see it even more. Um, which area do you lose more weight on the scale? Okay, um, let, hold on, let me answer this one first because that's about the picture. Is that with with or without diet and exercise? That is, I don't know. She is in deal and I am assuming that she exercises just because that's the culture. I'm just generalizing, you know, deal women are usually healthy um, or healthier lifestyle. They have the, that kind of lifestyle where they exercise. But as you could see, she wasn't getting results with just exercise. So this really, you know, um, clinched it for her. And then does it tighten the skin? Yes, it does tighten the skin. Um, especially if you use the firming cream that we sell as well, that gives you even better results in terms of weight loss. Um, someone asked that question. So M sculpt is not for weight loss. Um, M sculpt is for inches, for firmness, for tightening, for sculpting. It's not for weight loss, but because building muscle speeds up your metabolism, some people do find that because now their metabolism is better, they will lose some weight, especially because they flushed out some of the fat. Okay, great. Really good questions. Um, okay, are we ready to move on to our next category? I think so. Okay, so as we mentioned, um, 
MSculpt, the one, um, the main reason we have to turn people away from MSculpt, well, there's two. One is if someone, if their BMI is over 30, we turn them away. But the, the most common reason we have to turn them away is because they have the copper IUD, which is a form of birth control, which has, um, it's a metal that you cannot do MSculpt with if you have the IUD. So we, we kept getting requests to get something that the people with the IUD can do. And we finally got it. Um, we have it in Lakewood only for now, and we'll be getting it in other places also, Mertzshem. And it's called body cavitation. So Bina, can you sum up body cavitation for us? Yeah, yeah. So body cavitation, um, it's basically, it's a body sculpting treatment. Um, the only difference is it doesn't build muscle. Um, what it does is it gets rid of fat. Um, the treatment takes anywhere from 30 to 45 minutes, depending how much fat there is. Um, and also it drains out any like excess liquid from the lymphatic system and it gets rid of cellulite. Um, scheduling wise, it's also the same thing. It's like, uh, this uh, ultrasonic cavitation, we actually recommend doing eight sessions. Um, and it's also done twice a week. Um, Okay. So, oh, and another, um, another... It's, just, it's just different technology. It doesn't use uh, heat or electromagnetic frequencies. It's, uh, right. you know, it's, it's strictly, strictly cosmetic and it's amazing results. Okay. So um, a couple of advantages that it has over MSculpt is the body contouring, right? The fact that it actually contours the body also like shapes it. Um, collagen stimulation, right? It brings out collagen. Um which improves like your skin texture, texture and tightness. Um, and it also, um, MSculpt doesn't really get rid of cellulite, maybe minimally, but this does. Um, so with cellulite, if you, if you've ever tried, you know, it's very, very hard to completely get rid of cell cellulite, but it improves the, um, how cellulite looks. Um, okay. So I think most of the questions about this, we answered because in your description, um, it is not painful. That was one of the questions we got. It is not painful. Um, okay. I think we answered. also, it's also about the weight loss. You're also, you're not losing weight. You're losing inches. You're, it's firming. It's tightening. It's getting rid of cellulite. Right. Okay. Okay. Um, does anyone have questions about, um, about this, about body cavitation? I see a question about MSCO, but does anyone have any questions about, um, cavitation? Okay, so the someone asked for MSculpt, what should I do to maintain the results? So eating healthy, um, continuing exercising, if you've been exercising, and really the most important thing, like we cannot stress it enough, is drinking a lot of water. Um, after every session, during the day, in between sessions, drinking a lot of water. Um, can you explain it, Bina, meaning the scientific reason behind it? Behind drinking water? Yeah. It basically, um, while you're doing the treatment, um, the machine is basically like killing the fat cells. It's using heat to kill the fat cells on that area. So you need to drink water to just flush everything out. Okay. Okay. And it, yeah. And it drains out through your lymphatic drainage system. So that's why it's super important to drink, um, before and after your sessions, two cups before two cups after, and not to have, um, heavy meals, um, in between those two hours, preferably if you are going to eat something, have protein. Okay. Um, doesn't cellulite weigh something? No, it does not. And are there any bad side effects to cavitation? No, there are no, no bad side effects. Totally not. Um, okay. And by the way, I'm the type of person that like literally does not take medicine when I'm sick. Like I'm that type, you know, like, like it takes a lot for me to take a Tylenol when I have a huge headache. And I'm telling you that I, I, I do it. I do M sculpt on a regular basis, I'm a little bit hooked on it. Um, and like I said, I would put my, um, my teenager on it. Don't worry. I don't tell my teenagers that they need it. Don't worry. But I'm saying technically I would, and I would put my grandmother on it. Like that's how, um, not nervous I am about it. Um, okay. Our next topic is, um, Emsella. Okay. So I just want to introduce it for a second and then I'll let Bina talk about it. So Mcella is literally revolutionary. And I'll tell you, like I personally, I've had five C-sections. 
So I never struggled with what I hear from my clients all the time with the pelvic floor issues because it's usually it usually happens to people who have given vaginal birth because their pelvic floor weakens, right? I had the advantage, so to speak, in this case, advantage of C-sections. So I can't relate to it on a personal level, but I hear it at least like anywhere between five to 10 times a day. I wish I could drink water, but I can't because every time I drink too much, I have to run to the bathroom. I was in Disney and I had to run to the bathroom. I was at a graveside funeral and I had to run to the bathroom. It was so embarrassing. I was laughing hard at a joke that someone said and a little bit trickled out. Like it really affects people's quality of life. And what happens is, is, if they go to the doctor, right? So many people are embarrassed about it. Don't go to the doctor. Don't ask their doctor. But let's say they do. They go to a doctor or physical therapist and they're told to do Kegels, right? So like they're all motivated and they go home and they do a couple of Kegels. And then like, let's get real. Like no one really continues the Kegels because like it's tedious, it's annoying. And it's something that we just, whatever, don't do. So Msella is magical and revolutionary. Why? Because it performs 11,000 Kegels for you in 30 minutes, like all you have to do is sit there. That's it. And it performs 11,000 Kegels in 30 minutes, which is revolutionary. Um, Bina, are you able to post that video we have of like what it looks like? Like when you- The one that I, when I was yeah. doing it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. yeah. So um, oh. basically you're you're sitting on um, on like what looks like a pretty toilet bowl in your clothing. Okay. This is with clothing. It's not touching your body or your skin. Um, and it has electromagnetic stimulation. Um, and it literally performs the Kegels for you. Um, okay. So it's the same technology as M sculpt, which is why if you have the IUD or if you're pregnant or if you're nursing and your baby's not yet three months, you cannot do it. Um, okay. So let me see what else we had on it before while well, Bina's posting it. Um, so someone asked, what does it feel like? Um, Bina, you want to explain it? Wait, you're muted. Okay. She's sending the video. So, um, it feels like, um, like just like a vibration through your pelvic floor. Like it's like a gentle massage. Um, it's not painful. It actually feels good. Most people say it feels good. Um, how many sessions would someone need? Generally six sessions, 30 minutes each. Um, the results last for at least a year, but if you do it together with physical therapy, which is what we really want to talk about as well, the results will last you double the time and will be even better. So this is why we partnered with road to recovery, physical therapy. They have experienced therapists, female experienced therapists on staff that along with your treatment on them, sell a chair will also do physical therapy with you so that your, your results will be even better and last even longer. Um, is Vicky, Vicky, are you here? Bina, is Vicky on? Oh, okay. Vicky, yeah. You just have to unmute yourself. Trying to unmute myself. Hi, how are you? Okay. Hi, Vicky. How are you guys? You hey, want to introduce yourself and tell us a little Do bit about- Do you hear me? Yeah, we hear you. Okay, so my name is Vicki. I'm one of the owners of Road to Recovery Physical and Occupational Therapy. Um, we have multiple locations and we will be offering this service at currently at our Crown Heights and Williamsburg location. Um, we What makes our company a little bit different than others is that we have separate floors for male and female clients. So this procedure will be performed on a female floor only um, by female therapists. Um, when you, after your initial consultation with Tanya Urbina, um, then once you decide, once they determine if the package is something that you would qualify for, you would get a consultation by one of our trained physical therapists. And then they would guide you through the treatment. And then depending on your needs, um, they would instruct you on different exercises, if it's something that you're interested in, um, we could combine the treatment with physical therapy where they will be working on strengthening your pelvic floor through various different exercises, working on your core strength so that the results are longer lasting. Okay. Um, the For the physical therapy exercises, can you just give an example like, and so that they get an idea of what it is, like how much commitment is it? Meaning, is it doable? Is it painful? How much commitment is it? 
Okay. So the physical therapy exercise is not painful. Depending on the needs of the client, um, the a session would consist of anywhere between um, 45 minutes to an hour. Um, it's usually done twice a week. Um, so in conjunction with this treatment, so one of the main things that we usually recommend for clients is the Kegel exercises. Um, for uh, many of our clients, it's hard to understand exactly how to do a Kegel. Um, with this machine that you're going to be working with, it's going to be doing the Kegels for you. So it's going to be giving you that biofeedback so you really understand what a Kegel feels like. And that would help you with your exercises so that you can incorporate it more and further strengthen your pelvic floor. Um, in addition to just doing the Kegel exercises, there are quite a few other exercises that they incorporate as well. Um, they be working on your ab strength, your inner thigh strength, and working on the whole pelvic floor to make sure that, you know, your whole core is strengthened, which is something that is very important, especially after childbirth for people having continence. Basically, that's it. Okay. Okay, great. Thank you. Um, Bina, were you able to find the video? I did. Um, since I'm not the host, it doesn't let me share it. I'm only able to share photos. Um, I just forwarded it to you. So if you're able to share it, um, um no, because I'm on a laptop, so it's not. You're on a laptop. I see. But if, if, um, we have it on our Instagram, and we'll we'll share it. Um, yeah. We'll in the email. Um, so some questions that we got is how long is the treatment? I think we answered that it's thirty minutes. Um, how long is the recovery? There's no downtime for recovery. Um, how fast will I see results? So even faster than MSculpt, most people tell us that even after just one or two times, they are just running to the bathroom even like less. It, it, they already feel it. Um, who is an ideal candidate for MSculpt? So really anyone at any age, just people who want a better quality of life, who don't want to be bound to a bathroom or, you know, limited by them. Um, so that's kind of the questions that we got. And then someone asked um, how many sessions? Okay, we answer that. And then are there any other benefits? Um, there are. I'm just trying to see if um, there are any. Amen. <laughs> then, <laughs> there are. Um, I'm not sure how, I don't know who's on this Zoom, but oh, my video is off. Okay, sorry, one second. I just realized my video is off. Okay. Um, there are other benefits. Um, let's just say that, um, I mean, I don't know how to say it in a, in it, a... it, it improves intimacy. Thank you. That's a good classy way of saying it. Yes. Yeah. Um, for men and for women. So yeah. if anyone has specific questions about it, you can message us, but we don't want to get too technical on a recorded zoom with, you know, um, Okay. So anyone have any questions about um, Amsella before we go on to our last one? Any questions? Okay. Um, okay. And again, if anyone has like any questions after the call, um, I'll leave my number on the chat. Um, I, you know, any questions you have, I'm always here to help. Okay. Um, okay. Now let's talk about, um, just super quickly. Cause I know it's getting late. Um, just chin sculpting. Um, what is it? How does it work? Okay. Um, Tanya, do you want me to, you want me to answer? Okay. Yeah, yeah, go so, ahead. I have a okay. Here. So the chin sculpting machine is a little bit different than M sculpt is different technology. It uses cooling technology. Um, most people need two sessions, um, depending how much fat they have. Um, it's spaced out within uh, four weeks. So it's not like a huge commitment where you're coming in twice a week to do it. And what it basically does is um, it gives you like a nice contour jawline. It's uh, it freezes. It basically suctions and freezes out the fat. Um, and you come back four weeks later and you complete the treatment. It's very simple. It's non-invasive. It doesn't hurt. Um, it does leave a little bit of redness for like two, three days, but that's pretty much it. It's safe. It's FDA approved and, and people love it because, um, like realistically, you know, like you're, people are taking your pictures. Sometimes people feel a little bit like, um, self-conscious about themselves. So it really, really, really helps a lot. Um, the only thing that it doesn't work on, which I get questions about all the time and I do, um, 
virtual consultations is about the neck area. Because a lot of times when you get older, um, you get a little bit, you're, you don't have like as good elasticity as you do as when you're younger, naturally. So it doesn't help with that. It just helps with like some mental fat on that specific area. Okay. Um, what's the phone number? Six seven one eight six seven three four one zero seven. No, seven four zero seven. Oh, seven four. Yeah. Just... Yeah. Um. Okay. Does anyone have any questions about chin sculpting? Why isn't it sending my message? Oh. Okay. Oh, I know why. It's sending it as a direct message. Okay. No, I don't want a direct message. Um, Bina, maybe you type it because yeah. for some reason it's, um, let me see. Okay. So, um, Bina is going to put our number for everything. So whether you have any questions, whether you'd like a free consultation, whether in person or virtually, um, for anything, M sculpt, M cella, um, cavitation, chin sculpt, this is the number 718-673-7407. Um, someone asked, does anyone need more than two sessions? So um yes yeah. um not often but yes um they just have to wait um i think it's a month between each one right yeah you wait a month and you come back to do the second treatment um and you wait a little bit about like i would say like three four weeks to see the final results because it's also like just like any sculpting technology um the fat drains out through the lymphatic system so you want to make sure that you're completely healed okay. and then if we see you need more sessions um we can always do more. And um, how much does chin sculpting cost? So it's nine ninety nine for both sessions. Um, that and so is um so is Zemsella and so is M sculpt. It's all across. Um, we are going to be offering a discount for anybody that was on the Zoom. So we're going to be e emailing it out. So stay tuned. And if you were on the Zoom, you could get a discount for any of the services. Um, okay. So last chance. Any questions? On anything, M sculpt, M cella, chin sculpt, cavitation, um, any questions or comments? Okay. Um, so we want to just thank everyone for joining and thank you, Vicky, and thank you, Bina. Um, and uh, thank you everyone for taking the time out. And we hope we answered some of your questions. And if any more questions, let us know. Okay. Oh, we got one more question. Um, where can I do more research on all these services? Um, you can always Google it. There's a lot of information there. Yeah. the If you Google oh. M-Sculpt, you'll see that out of all the body sculpting procedures out there, M-Sculpt really has the highest, highest reviews. Um, you know, when, when cool sculpting uh, came out and then there were bad reviews on it, the whole sculpting thing got a little bit of a bad rep, but don't get confused between the two. You'll see when you read up on M-Sculpt and m -Sella, you'll see there are awesome, awesome reviews um, for people um okay thank you everyone for your nice messages and awesome questions and taking the time out and um hopefully we'll hear only good news in general and everyone's health and in the world and only good and um have a good night everybody